Hi, Brentek here, where tech is made simple. So at the beginning of November last year, I let you know that Microsoft had officially confirmed and had started testing Windows 11 26H1. And that was in the Canary channel with build 28000. I'll leave the video link down below and in the end screen if you'd like some more information. Now, although Microsoft had confirmed it was testing Windows 11 26H1 in the Canary channel, Microsoft didn't give us any information of when exactly 26H1 will roll out. All we know is it will be in the first half of this year. Now, in regards to this, some more information has come to light, so I'm just going to do this quick video to keep you guys in the loop. And just a quick recap, Microsoft had said that 26H1 is not a feature update for version 25H2 and only includes platform changes to support specific silicon. Okay, now that specific silicon is referring to CPUs. And we might now have a timeline when 26H1 is going to roll out because recently Qualcomm has confirmed that it's going to start rolling out its new Snapdragon X2 based PCs, which are Copilot Plus PCs, by the end of the first quarter of this year, 2026, which would be basically end of April, beginning of May, which gives us a bit of a better timeline now that version 26H1 could roll out around that timeline and that time frame, end of April, beginning of May, which makes a lot of sense in the first half of 2026. And as I've mentioned previously, 26H1 is only going to be made available on new ARM64 devices. So for now, these new ARM64 PCs are Snapdragon X2 based PCs, as mentioned. Which means if you run a PC with an Intel or AMD chip, you won't be getting Windows 11 26H1. And although this is the case, if we head back to that change log, Microsoft has confirmed that Windows 11 is sticking to the annual feature update cadence with releases in the second half of the calendar year. So, that, so that'll be called 26H2, which will be our annual feature update, which everyone will get, which there's a good chance will start rolling out between October and November, which Microsoft is known to do. So all PCs will get Windows 11 26H2 rolling out in the second half of this year. But there has been a bit of interest regarding 26H1. So I thought I'd just pop this quick video up just to kind of get us all on the same page. And in regards to what's going to be rolling out with 26H1 to those Copilot Plus PCs, I don't think there's going to be too much in regards to major front-facing features. I think there are going to be minor tweaks and adjustments when it comes to AR features. That's why Microsoft is only rolling it out to Copilot Plus PCs with that, as Microsoft calls it, specific silicon. But with all that said and done, at least now we have a better time frame when 26H1 could be arriving. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.